commercial drone pilot in Thunder Bay is applauding the new rules for flying the devices as a hobby in Canada. Until now, recreational drone pilots had only guidelines to follow, but they're now facing much stricter regulations. Those new laws are also welcome news to airline companies. Luisa Alvarez reports. They certainly seem like a fun toy, and flying them may look easy, but these drones are a radio signal controlled aircraft and are anything but a toy. Alan Ald runs his own film company in the city. He says commercial drone operators like himself have already had to follow strict rules for years regarding how high and where they can be flown. He says many amateurs are unaware of the dangers and these rules are necessary to keep everyone safe. Uh, we're always wondering why were we penalized when the amateurs can get away and do whatever they want without consequence. And I think now leveling that playing field, it's uh, making them have some responsibility and accountability. Incidents involving drones and commercial planes have more than tripled between 2014 to 2016, which prompted these new regulations. Drone operators must now have a special flight operations certificate if they're being used within nine kilometers of an airport. Officials from Bearskin Airlines and Porter Airlines are also applauding the new rules. Porter CEO Robert DeLuce says safety governs everything they do as an airline. So whatever can be done to improve safe operations of drones is a worthwhile effort. Our Thunder Bay Airport is right in the city. Uh, those planes, they're flying down Arthur Street from end to end. And, uh, and they're coming in at around 500 feet before they land. These drones can go up to uh, several thousand feet and very quickly. So to uh, get in the, the line of a plane is, is quite dangerous. And for someone who just goes out to buy one and doesn't put much thought in there, that's a, that's a dangerous thought. Drones can't be flown higher than 90 meters from the ground, be 75 meters within people, animals or buildings, and your name address and phone number must be clearly marked on your drone. Penalties for failure to comply with these new regulations can be up to $3,000. Luisa Alvarez, TBT News.